Isn't that so great, bro? Like, I think that's my favorite oh, thing. Fuck football, bro. This is better. Dude. Yeah. Uh, today we got a five versus five because uh, we can get any subs in today. We got the blue team, uh, which is the junior London Spitfire. And then you got the red team, which is the junior Dallas Fuel. And welcome to the Overwatch Little Leagues. And today we are playing on the map Elios Well. Let's see how this turns out. So judging by the uh, blue team's team comp, uh, which is Ryan, Anna, Roadhog, Lucio, and Junkrat. It's not a horrible comp. Uh, not the greatest comp for this map, though. They could have definitely ran an Arisa and a Hog. But the Ryan Hart uh, is not too bad. I do believe that uh, Biggie Smalls, or Baige Smalls, is not the best Arisa in the town. So they're going to have to make this work. On the red team, we got an Arisa. We got a... Anna, we got a uh, Ash and a Roadhog and a Lucio. This team comp is way, 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 way better than the blue team's team comp. From what I'm seeing so far, I'm pretty sure that the red team will take the first map. We got the Junkrat flanking. Stranger going in for a kill. Hog misses hook. Not great. He's getting pressured. There, Ryan went in hardcore. He's anteed. Took a little too long to put his shield up. And is going to die from the dynamite. Oh, but his Anna saves him. He goes in again. Past the shield. Unable to get healing. But is able to back out. Gets a massive pull by freaking Cacti. Oh my goodness. IBZ misses hook. Gets boot back in. Are they going to be able to finish the point? Yes, yes, they are going to take the point. 20% for blue team, and red has it capped. What's going to happen next? We got a the red team with the alt advantages currently, and the blue team, which has a tire. The tire could work out well for them, seeing as how uh, close together that the red team is playing currently. Rebel has taken a very odd position, but it seems to be working out pretty well. No one's uh, doing anything about him. The Aris all has shown where Rebel is. And we got Typical going down with an ult, and it actually worked out pretty well. We were able to kill their Ryan. They have no shield now, and they're all stuck in a room. They don't really know what's going on, and they're starting to split off from each other. This isn't great. They get pulled in. Cacti with another huge pull. Absolutely great. We got the Junkrat coming around. Spamming nades, probably unable to do anything though. Puts a trap down, gets hooked, and it looks like he has met his end. Oh, nope, they're just too bad to freaking kill him. Okay, next up, we got the fire strike coming out of Biggie. Almost gets booped in, but is able to save himself. Gets hooked, not booped in again, is anti though. Doesn't look great for him. Another huge pull by Cacti, he's popping off. Absolutely huge. Absolutely huge. Rebel's up here being an annoying little mosquito, taking little nicks here and there. Josh is coming up for a flank, it looks like, but is unable to get up there to him. He looks like he's waiting to get hit to him. They're both standing on the same building. Alright, we're having another engagement soon. Junkrat just spamming. We need a cap from the blue team to win this. Huge beat, and huge ults coming out here. We got the IVZ ult, unable to do anything. Now we got the nano. Huge anti! Huge, 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 huge anti. We're going in. Bob is popping the heck off, doing tons of damage. Typical's doing damage. Horrible, horrible ult by our Junkrat. He should have gone for a more of a flank if he was going to go for it. Or maybe just gone up and killed Rebel. Either one would have worked better. We got Curtis painfully holding the point by himself right now. Josh comes in trying to help. Throws a fire strike. Tags a couple. But it looks like this might be it for the blue team. Yes, there it goes. Ryan and their Lucio is unable to touch point. Score. 
Wow. Really, really good first map for the red team. Let's see what they changed to. They are no longer running an Orisa. They are running, it seems to be a dive comp. It seems a little weird because they're running a dive comp with an Ash. But with no other DPS, it could work, honestly, since it's a 5 versus 5 if the Ash stays more in the back. But we'll see how they play this. On the blue team, we have a, uh, looks to be a death ball comp with a Widowmaker, which is a much better comp. I am actually going for the blue team to win this next map here. We got snipes coming from IVZ right now. Unable to land the first shot. Unable to land the second shot. No one's actually touched the point yet, which is okay. They don't need to. They still have time. Okay, blue team is starting to group up on point as it comes ready. They're diving their, their Widow, and they got it. They got the kill. They left their Widow stranded out there. Huge purple on the Winston, and he gets killed. As expected, Roadhog does counter Winston, and that's what happened. Missed the hook on the Lucio, but is pressuring him. And blue team seems to be pretty split up. They need to get back on point if they're going to win. Their Roadhog is prolonging his death. I feel like he thinks he can still win it with his Reaper friend here. He misses another hook. Is spamming at D.Va, though. It doesn't look like it's going to happen for blue team. And I was correct. The red team is able to take it back. 21% for the blue team before they got it taken. Let's see here. We got a Roadhog alt coming up. And a Reinhardt alt coming up for the blue team here. And we got the Diva Bomb for red team. So, blue does have a slight alt advantage for... The first part of this fight. They do hammer a D.Va, which is a questionable choice to hammer, seeing as how she does have her ult. And that shield was really, really bad. Um, we're just not going to talk about that. Uh, okay, we got the anti D.Va. Uh, we got a Reaper struggling to focus it without his team there. And is dead. Blue team is struggling to stay close together right now. They are also struggling to focus the same target. It's okay, though. They still have time to take it back. Okay, red team has by far the alt advantage. They didn't use any alts that fight except for the Diva Bomb. So they do have four of their five ultimates with the blue team only getting close to their nano. Huge pin coming in from Biggie Smalls. His team follows him up this time, which is good. Even with the Primal, they're able to stay together, which is really, really good. And none of them are panicking so far. They stay together, and they, as well, are also focusing two different targets right now. But as long as they're still stuck together, it seems to be working okay. Bob is on point. Will they do anything about it? A Shatter on the Lucio, but no one focused him. They failed to follow up. Okay, he blocked the the diva bomb there and they used all their alts they do have a nano boost which they should put on biggie smalls right now was unable to deliver to biggie smalls and now we have both the support alts now they are dead and are probably going to be unable to get back with their ultimates struggling to get kills on point it is dallas fuel jr win